Aaron Siegfried's Motorworks. Today we're giving you our third episode of What's Up at Motorworks, what's supposed to be our weekly series, but uh, we're going to improve on that, so stay tuned. Tyler's behind the camera today, but let's get after it. We have a 2018 Honda Grom that we just got in stock. This one has a whole pile of aftermarket stuff done to it. Um, nothing as far as mechanicals, just all cosmetic stuff. This one's a real sharp bike. Uh, pay attention for the uh, inventory walk around on this one. As soon as it's up, I'll link it in the video. We also got a 2005 Honda Rebel 250 in stock. We're stocking all the small CC stuff right now. But um, this one's in really nice shape. A couple of small things, but again, watch for the walk around video on that. As soon as it's not so windy, we're going to get that video up here for you guys. Over here, we still have the Shadow 1100. The A to B, every time you turn the key bike. We have this 06 uh, soft tail in stock still. Super clean bike. If you're looking for a soft tail, that's the one you want. We just finished up our 2005 Dyna Wide Glide. Um, here again, this bike has a bunch of stuff done to it. Uh, a little higher miles, but if you're looking for a cheap Harley, this is the one you want. I'm going to put a link to it on the website as soon as I get the pictures posted. Uh, that one is for sale at smwx717.com. We have a 2018 Harley Davidson Breakout 114. This does have the Milwaukee 8 motor. Uh, it has some punched out baffles on it, but other than that, this one's bone stock. Super sharp bike. Uh, this one's going to be on the website as soon as we get a. Uh, all the paperwork lined out with it. It's going to be on consignment. So if you want a breakout and you want one cheap, don't miss this bike. In the back in our service department, in our service department, we have just hired a director of human resources. Gave it a new position up there on the wall. But we also are finishing up a 2008 Yamaha C3 50cc scooters. If you follow the channel, you know how much we love these C3s. Our opinion, one of the best 50cc four-stroke scooters they ever made. This one should be done in the next week. Um, completely fresh enough motor. It's going to be getting completely all new plastic. So if you're looking for a C3, we're going to have one of the cleanest ones for sale in the country. We also have the 2018 Honda Grom. Again, this one has a whole pile of aftermarket stuff done to it. Um, we're going to be changing out some of the stuff on this to put it uh, more name brand stuff on it. But this one will be for sale once we finish fully servicing it. Um, we're also going to use this for an exhaust comparison video with the Grom. So if you're looking for a Grom exhaust and you don't know which one to go with, we're going to have a review on two good options for you guys. Here we have a 1984 Honda Elite 125. This scooter was in the second What's Up at Motorworks video. Um, this is my personal scooter that I own. It's going to be our first over 50cc shop build. We're going to be doing a whole pile of stuff to this thing. Um, it's not going to look like it's from 1984 anymore. But um, really excited about this one. So if you're into old JDM scooters, Pay attention for this one. Over in the back, we have a Gen 1 Yamaha FJ1200 uh, Sport Touring Bike. Super awesome, clean bike. Has ABS, it's from the early 90s and has ABS on it, which is pretty wild. Um, we're going through that one. It's the customer's a good friend of ours, figuring out if we're gonna buy it or not. So if you're looking for an FJ1200, we have the line on a super clean Gen 1. We also have this MXZ 700. This thing's in here for a couple little issues. We're gonna be working through that. Um, if you have snowmobiles in Pennsylvania, it's getting close to heading and ready to go out. If yours doesn't start, doesn't run the way you want, give us a shout. We can get you in and get you ready for the snow. Um, other than that, same bikes have been in the back, but uh, it is winter time. It's a great time to get your bike serviced. We're gonna be putting up some DIYs. If there's any kind of video that you wanna see, a shop's perspective on what to do. Make a request, put a comment in, and we'll uh, try and get after it for you guys. But other than that, thank you for watching the video. Please like this channel, or like this video, and subscribe to this channel, and we'll catch you guys on the next video.